Hello baby thanks for coming to dinner with me tonight. No need to be nervous babe, I just wanted to take you out to listen to a little Marvin Gaye and drink Chardonnay you dig. No problem. This is a really nice restaurant nigga. I'm just wondering why you're doing all of this. Well there is one thing I've been meaning to tell you. We'll talk after dinner though, okay babe? You're getting me a little scared Eric. Are you sure this can wait? I can't eat dinner feeling this way. Don't question me bitch. I said after dinner. I need food in my body. I just had my colonoscopy and have not eaten in two days you selfish whore. Okay. Okay. I'm sorry Eric just a little curious. Fuck you. Whereas the goddamn waiter? This restaurant. Line on your bella sucks. Can't I get a Pellegrino or water? Niggas are dying of thirst right now. Now I know what it felt like when Haiti had that earthquake. How dare you Eric. I can't believe I married such a cruel, nasty man. When you say things like that it makes me think so different of you. I am disgusted. Thoughts not the man I fell in love with. I swear you should have married a nigger. All you do is complain. Button up your motherfucking lip and stop patronizing me in public. I just would like to eat. Preferably some salmon and I want a Cosmo. I'm feeling a little gay tonight. After this me and these gang crew are supposed to run a train on some groupie hole we met at Dizzy's last night. Real nigga was up. Run a train? What does that even mean? Who are you anymore? I don't even feel connected to you anymore Eric. What happened to you? Ever since you started chilling with Miguel Ponce you've become an untamed gorilla. Guess that's what Elmont does to you. Don't talk about my boy Miguel before I crisp brown the shit out of you. I never understood that song he made called. I wanna see you tonight. I wanna see you tonight was probably just code word for I want to beat the shit out of your face and then cry about it on TV like I am sorry. Ha ha silly ass nigga. Look Eric. This date obviously isn't going well so please just tell me what you had to tell me and I want to go home. Fine if you beg me. Okay well look. Remember that night when me and the crew went to the Wiz Khalifa concert and we smoked three ounces to the face? Yes unfortunately. Why? Well. That night I just accidentally happened to pocket dial your sister and we started talking. And? Well she invited me to make cookies and drink some milk with her. And next thing you know she was sitting on my face in the new hot tub. I really don't know what happened. That coconut vodka had me all wavy and shit. Well I just wanted to inform you that me and her will be getting married and we actually have a child on the way now. So I am unfortunately going to be needing that ring back I got for you when we got married last June because since it's Christmas in three days niggas is broke. So sorry and hope your life turns out great. And I'll see you during the holidays as at my new mother-in-law's house. I still love you I am sorry. Happy New Year to be real bitches ain't shit but hoes and tricks. Deuces pop.